Today at the Purdue University Airport, Boeing and Saab debuted a new T-7A Red Hawk fighter jet that was partially built here in West Lafayette. The Red Hawk is designed by Saab in Sweden, but developed here in America, where a major part of the plane is developed in a factory here in West Lafayette. I would simplify it and say that if you look sort of from the cockpit and aft of the cockpit is sort of the thing we delivered to, to Boeing, and that's sort of been transported to St. Louis, and then they are sort of put it together in a very short time actually yeah. uh, to make an aircraft. Boeing currently has 350 jets scheduled to be developed for the U.S. Air Force, but Steve Parker, president and CEO of Boeing Defense Space and Security, says there could be demand for more. But we see a market here of two to 3,000 worldwide outside of the U.S. and we are perfectly positioned with this leading edge capability and again, it's, it's the strength of the partnership, you know, the aircraft is amazing. President and CEO of Saab, Michael Johansson, says he sees an opportunity for growth here in West Lafayette. We have ramped up to sort of, we have set up the production uh, quite sort of forward leaning and employing people who I think is 233, 240 -ish now. And if we need to go further than that, we will do that. Of course, we have the land, we can expand the facility. So that's where we are today. But we can definitely support the rates that uh, Steve will need uh, in St. Louis. The first fighter jet will be delivered to an Air Force base in Texas and will be used for pilot training. Ryan Gage, Star City News, West Lafayette.